Say what I want like I'm Taylor My kind kinda white like Taylor Sweet Taylor yeah. We're back and I was just asking we're gonna do Ren with Sick Boy. You know what I'm saying? So y'all had suggested that we tap into Ren's music specifically. Okay, so that's what we're gonna do, you know what I'm saying? Cause I know y'all, y'all, y'all feel however y'all felt about the big push reaction. It was all good, cause we're entitled to our opinions. Ha ha. How's that make you feel? The girls <laughs> that get it, get it. And the ones that don't don't, you know? It's okay. You the sick boy. <laughs> and or a girl, who knows? But I want you to know what you're gonna do if you don't like this reaction. All right, so if I don't like this reaction, right, what I'm going to do is get my hammer. I'm going to get my bottle, and I'm going to knock the bottle if I don't like the video, okay? But if I do like the video, we got some talent and all of those good things, okay? I'm going get to get that thing and whew, whew, hit him with one of those. So let's see what we're working with today. Sad boy, sick boy, lover boy? Sick boy. Sick boy. Sick boy. Sick boy. Hi Ren, thank you for coming in today. Thanks for seeing me. Looking at your file here, it seems there's a very apparent interplay with your emotional state and your physical body. Have you ever heard of the trauma response? I don't think so. Basically, our bodies can get stuck in a negative feedback loop. Our subconscious can repeat patterns from the past, which can have a pretty drastic downstream effect in our biology. To break, boy. Oh, what a shame. He's in pain. Have another go. Take another pill. Here, take a couple more. Let's see how you're doing. It's probably what they told uh, Michael Jackson. What is snake <laughs> oil? Sound like some stuff, though. <laughs> I don't know. It's like probably get you hot for weeks. Snake oil? <laughs> you put a little snake oil Where in Where do we even get oh. that? That's probably like, yeah, we actually take snakes and then drain the the, the poison, boil it, so it takes out the poison. And... Imagine what's your job to jerk a snake to get the oil out of it. Ew. To get the oil out That's a crazy job description. Yeah, you know, I jerk snakes. I, I'm about 30 an hour. <laughs> you know, that's what it is. Thanks, 30 man. an hour? Nah. To, to milk a poisonous snake? That's, that's too I much. Need, that, I need more! A oh. poisonous snake? Are you kidding me? Not every snake nah. is poisonous. I don't give a... F <laughs> <laughs> I don't care. <laughs> I need more money than that if I'm going to be putting myself in such dangerous situations. <laughs> yeah, this is definitely a switch from um, the uh, covers um, of Bob Marley. Like you, went from, you went from covering Bob Marley to being oh, sick and, and jerking the snakes. the lead singer of the big push. I yeah, see. Okay. Indeed. I understand. Yeah, he's yeah, a sick boy. Sick boy, sick boy. Okay. Sick, Let's sick, see. sick. And have another go. Take another pill. Here, take a couple more. Let's see how you're doing in another week or so. You'll be feeling worse when the side effects will show. Derealization, medical patient. Losing patience with the process. Walking hand in hand with Satan. Complications with the medication. Inflammation, dehydration, inhalation, aggravation. Building up a toleration. Drown, soccer, drown, soccer, drown, soccer, drown. I've been feeling like I'm drowning with my feet upon the ground. I've been screaming, I've been shouting, but I never make a sound. I've been looking for the way out, but I always seem to drown. Is this all making sense, Ren? Um, yeah, I think so. Good. What I propose we do is we try to pinpoint the exact experiences from the past that are keeping you stuck. What can you tell me about your childhood? I can't really think. It's okay if nothing comes up right away. What I'd like you to do is take some deep breaths with me. In and out. In and out. Good. Now tell me the first thing that comes to your mind. I've been thinking about how the little pig mask reminds me of Saul. You think he was inspired <laughs> by that? He seems like he's into that. Nah, he definitely, he's he's into some stuff. Yeah. He looks like he probably studied the human centipede. You ever seen that movie? Yeah. He probably, he probably like gets, it gets into gross. those. I like horror movies though, so I've also seen all the gory stuff. Heard about you? Yeah. Yeah, I haven't even seen human centipede. By Interesting. That. So I wonder if this is, if he's like, is, this, is, he, is he just talking about this or is he... 
actually kind of telling us about his issues. I feel know? like music is a outlet, no matter how people try to make it seem like they're just coming from a third person perspective. I'm very captivated he, into the, the story he's telling. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like what's gonna happen? Kind I of think thing. a person but that can like, play a it's like boom, like even the guy that the played Joker that killed himself, right? Yeah. With Heat Ledger, he probably had like some real stuff going on. So that when he, by the time he got so deep into that character acting of being the Joker, it, it like yeah, it was a lot right. going on. It just sent him over the rails because it was probably mixed with what he was already going on in his brain. So yeah, he could probably say. I'm just, you know, doing this for the sake of of uh, music and and you know character development for a song and a video mm-hmm. to make to make you know a whole story and tell a story. But <laughs> he probably a little sick. He probably really like that. You know what I'm saying? No, no. You know what's crazy? All right. You never know. No facts. Cause I actually did react to another Ren video. I forgot uh-huh. this. I reacted to another Ren video. My damn uh, my story ran up on my computer, so y'all not gonna see that one. I go live. But he actually says that he has like some type of like mental disorder. He actually does say he has like some mental. In the last like song that I bipolar or something. It's not bipolar. I looked. I looked it up. Cause I was like, I don't know what this is. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So actually, yeah, he does have some stuff going on. I go live. You know that sucks. I think everybody has some level of a mental disorder. Yeah, I do think it's subjective. But some people just... I feel like growth is supposed to come from like learning to deal with yourself. And I do understand that some people like mental state or just like mental, just the way people think, prevent them from like working with themselves sometimes, if that makes sense. So, I don't know. When you have a one-of-a-kind idea, even the people you look up to might not be able to see that vision. So at times, it's better to make moves in silence. Let that success speak for itself. You know, I mean, based on this song, it seems pretty intense. Like he doesn't very, he doesn't look, he doesn't look happy and out of balance of medication. Like he looks, he looks. He looks like he needs help. He's going through some stuff. Like, yeah. But think, that's dope, though. What do you think your mental disorder is? I think if I... I, I don't know. I don't, I don't know. My aunts are bipolar, but I don't really know what that would feel like. You know? So you don't think you're bipolar? I don't, I don't think I'm bipolar. Okay. But do you think you have no mental disorder at all? Um, not like a regular, no, I don't, no, I don't think, I don't think so, I, I hope not, like, I hope not, I've been, like, depressed, but I feel like everyone gets depressed, right? Okay. I think everybody has to have a level of mental disorder, even if it's not, uh, like, if there's, like, a type maybe, one Maybe I have, five. like, narcissistic tendencies. I think narcissism is a mental disorder. Yeah, you know, so I'm not like a psychopath, but mm-hmm. I think I think there's levels. Like maybe like you're not a top five narcissist. Maybe like type one, type two, or whatever. <laughs> I don't want to be a type at all. We're hypothetical. <laughs> I mean, I'm just saying. I but no, 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 no. I feel you though. You know, just a little bit. You know, it's okay. Bye, go. What's yours? I think I have multiple personality disorder. Interesting. A little bit. Like um, the guy from Split. I never seen the movie. <gasps> you gotta watch the movie. Oh, you definitely don't be watching. <laughs> I always forget because I'm just like, oh, Taylor would love this. <laughs> and he, he it just should. got like maybe we have like a teen movie night or something. That's the only <gasps> way I can watch movies. Like, That's like. a great idea. You have a projector. Yeah, I do. Have a <gasps> we should totally do teen movie nights. Oh my god, can you suggest this movie? <laughs> <laughs> Comments in down below. You know. Not the whole movie reaction, but what do they oh, do yeah, at yeah, the end? Yeah. Review. We'll yeah, do yeah, a yeah. movie we'll do review. review. <laughs> or we'll do movie trailer reactions. I used to do that on my other channel. Okay, that's yeah, a vibe. Yeah. No, yeah. Yeah. Hilarious that we just brought that up because on my music media channel, you can check that out. Uh, L Jazz reacts. I think I was reacting to like a uh, trailer, a movie trailer. On, uh, it was like a movie that came out like literally like, three years ago where like the guy is like the, the it's like these two black kids and like the police officer shoots the guy because the black kid because he went to go pull for his like hairbrush or something. You know what that is, and it's called like the hate, the hate me now or something like that. I'll show you after. Mm-hmm. But um, yeah, that person literally just commented on it. I got like, I got, I got, I got pulled up right now because it was hilarious. I'm just, I'm gonna just tell you right now because I read to this video literally three years ago, and somebody commented on recently? it recently. Yeah, somebody commented on it yesterday, and I read to it three years ago. 
and and they <laughs> that'd be me on people's YouTube. I'd be like, damn, this came out in twenty eighteen. The that hate you still... give. The hate. The movie's called The Hate You Give. Uh, and I and the title the title of the video is called The Hate You Give Movie Reaction. Why I pick up the brush? Because in the movie trailer, he gets shot for picking up the, for for going for the brush, and I guess the police officer thinks it's a gun, right? So the person comments in all caps. This is in all caps. He needs a hairbrush is because he probably needs to fix his hair. And the effing cop shot him because he thought that was a gun or a weapon. And I love this movie. I don't care what you think or say. Why I love this movie, question mark, is because I have effing black friends and I'm biracial. This is what got me, though. This is what got me, y'all. <laughs> this is what got me, though. Because I was, I was really weak until I got to this part, too. Why I love this movie is because I have effing black friends and I'm biracial. Why I'm biracial is because my dad is black and my mom is white, so I'm mixed. Black and white. <sighs> Man, them had to explain to me why that they were biracial. I'm like, I think he I know what biracial means. Sure, yeah, yeah, he's the sick boy. Yeah. He or she, because the name says Sierra. Sierra Dupe, Dup, uh, I, won't, I won't expose your whole joint like that, but Sierra, Sierra, so you could be a girl, you could be a guy, I don't know, you, you might be the sick girl and or, and or boy. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> You got some stuff going on, okay? But uh, let's get back to rent. In and out. Good. Now tell me the first thing that comes to your mind. I feel like it's not me. It's the world that's it. We're given everything we need and we commoditize it. We consume, we destroy like we're parasitic. Science tells us that it's suicide and still we come in. I'm not sick. We are sick. We are standing on a cliff in the name of progress. We jump off the precipice. I'm not sick. I'm the virus. You're the virus hypocrite. How can you sit there with a smile on and tell me that I'm sick? Sick boy, sick boy, looking for a fix boy. Push it down in public, quick toes for the pig boy. Record label meetings that come on the fire, your gift boy. Why are you so upset? Don't you wanna be a rich boy? Fuck no, industry is cutthroat. I've been doing bits for myself, swimming backstroke, walking on a tidal, rapping with a slip throw. The way that we persist is like the ending of a bad joke. As the people of old, we're complacent to assailants and we do what we're told. Counterintelligence is like the whole. Rape the earth of all resources and we bleed it for gold. And we bleed it for wealth, we bleed it for fame. But when you bleed it, can you tell me what the fuck will remain? And I'm bleeding myself, I'm bleeding my brain. While I'm bleeding, I'm the reason, cause I'm doing the same. This one, I read to the high end. I read to the high end. I think this is like probably the precursor, or maybe no. This is probably this is probably the precursor to this. Cause this is an Iron video. <laughs> but oh, it's one of those yeah. like a story. The story is the song. So he's story rapping like... from two different parts of his brain. You know, like his oh, like the cool. evil brain. And uh, so I actually, what I said, and so I'll give you a little sneak peek. What I said. Well, I only say sneak peek because I don't even know if I feel like I did the whole thing again. But it was um. So like I'm saying, I, they could have did more to differentiate him. In his evil brain and his, like, I guess, regular brain. But I guess with what he's trying to portray, he's just crazy in general. <laughs> and maybe just has multiple personality disorders. So, this, so he doesn't have to, like, differentiate to the public what is evil and what is the good brain because they both live inside of him, I guess. Uh, you, know, you know how people do, like, the whole two-faced thing. Like, oh, yeah, this is... Um, like even Melly, Melly did Melly vs. Melvin with his cover art, you know, for one of his oh, albums. Oh yeah. Like so stuff like that. Yeah. So the concept is not like the most different different thing in the world, right? But um, it was a cool, it was a cool video. I, I liked it. It was, it was, it was definitely a uh, creative and whatnot, or him just telling us what's really going on in his brain. <laughs> I don't know, but. I mean, after seeing this, maybe it is. Yeah. You know? Now you see a little disturbed. Yeah. <laughs> that was Ren showing us a different side of of uh, you know, Ren. <laughs> okay, but yeah, how did you about those? Um, I thought it was cool. The video itself was cool. It was definitely like cinematic. I'm y'all watching my reaction, so I was like watching it. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> I was. I don't even think my face was moving. I was. <laughs> I was hella into it. Um, it was cool though, and some of it was like catchy, and I feel like I felt it, which I feel like is important. You know, rather mm. than being like, "What am I listening to the whole time?" I was actually like, oh, "Okay, what else?" You know. Mm. So, I feel like that was cool. Was he rapping? Is that like a thing he does often, or like is he a singer? Is he a sing? He's I mean, just he's an sung artist, in, you know. Sung, like, I was just maybe maybe probably just an artist because I think that that's creative oh, stuff. Actually, though. yeah. Maybe he sung in the Big Bush thing. I was gonna say he also rapped because he did a hip hop the hip hop song. Yeah, thing at the I think he's just overall so, okay, very creative dude. Up, yeah. Now. 
an artist for sure. Cool. I'll give him, I'll give him that for sure. Different. Um, I like that, and I appreciate his vulnerability. So I'm gonna have to whoop, whoop, give him one of those. What's that thing out? <clears throat> Bam. You know Shout out to Ren. Hi, Ren. Hi. Don't uh, I want to send you a good side though. You 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 low key give me like the guy in the back of the class that didn't say nothing until somebody told him a bad joke. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Give it, you was making the moves in silence. That's what you was doing. You was making moves in silence until you you hit that that real move. <laughs> until you made that until you made that move. And I'm not putting that on you. Hopefully you wasn't that type of guy. But you know, judging on the music that I've seen so far. <laughs> but shout out to you though, very talented individual. You saying that's gonna do for this episode of L Jazz Reacts. But you know, I also enjoyed the song. I think I said that. But anyway, uh, that's gonna do it for this episode of L Jazz Reacts. Make sure you go ahead and uh, subscribe to the channel. Turn on the post notification bell so every time we drop a new damn video, make sure you follow Taylor Jazz on TikTok and Instagram for more funny and satirical content. Where can I find you at? You guys can follow me on Instagram. My name is Aphrodite with an F. So make sure you follow me at Aphrodite.bk because your girl is from Brooklyn. Okay, make sure you tap into my music and keep watching our videos. No okay, cap. I'm gonna put the I'm gonna put your pre pre save link in, in 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 the description. Hey, yes. Make sure y'all pre save my project. Growing pains dropping May fifth on all platforms. It's gonna be great. If you hate it, you can let me know. Okay, just like you let me know how much you hated our opinion <laughs> on the last video. You can let me know. <laughs> like I think that's important because that sometimes their criticism of us is that they think that, and even me too, when I do it by myself, is that oh yeah, ha, does it make you feel good just breaking down people's stuff? But how about you do it? And all right. We both actually make music. So you know what? Go ahead, yeah, go ahead right. and tap go in. Ahead, go ahead and like... tap in. You know what I'm saying? It's cool. Go ahead and tap in. Okay. It's all good. Go look at my Instagram, all of that. Let me, you know. let me know. My name is Taylor Jazz. Watch your Tetris. Big Reaper and I'm back for the killing. When I get on the track, they what I'm actually feeling. I'm a murder baby. You my next victim, maybe. 